Hello folks, Dirtnaps Dad here. Today we're playing an arena match. Now, so far we have a Terra and a Kali, a Poseidon. Leaves up a hunter or a warrior. Oh, you know, I like to play some warriors. Odin. Let's get some Odin. My Odin's beard. Let's play him. See what we can do. Just waiting for uh, Mr. Toon on the way to pitch in his two cents here. Agni. All right. Interesting. Well, give us three magic, two physical. Still a good team comp. With Terra here, I'm going to be going a little more offensive, hopefully. We'll see how the match plays out. Because I don't like to just do a standard build match to match. I have things I like to do and, and, and so forth, but I think a lot of times it comes down to... Who am I up against? Athena, Vulcan, Erlang, Shen, Daji, Nice. Okay. It's a nasty little combo there. Some ones that I don't like. I think Daji is a bit overpowered right now. I think the buff was unwarranted. Now that people know how to play her, the buff is just a bit overkill. But I'm sure they'll get it balanced out. And Erlang Shen's either ruin me or I ruin them. And if uh, we just get moving along here a little bit, maybe get 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 moving along. We seem to be in the twilight zone. Oh, there we go. All right, so one Kali, a four Agni, a one Poseidon, my three Odin, and a no stats Terra. No stats Erlang, uh, 8 Daji, already, uh, a 9 Neath, 8 Athena, and 4 Vulcan. Not a lot of fantasy points down on that level, and some very high ones up here. So that gives us the recent experience advantage, although they have the overall mastery advantage. So we'll see how things go here. I always take uh, all these little skin vantages, fantasy point advantages, and so forth with a grain of salt. Now, you may be asking yourself, why the Teleria boots? Well, it's because it works with me. It works great with Odin and the Bird Bomb. Yeah, we're definitely going to go with beads here and see what we can build. Yeah, so first things first, we'll go out and we'll get our buffs here. And I always like to keep a wary eye to make sure that no enemy team's uh, sneaking their way over here. Had that happen quite a few times and can get you in a lot of trouble real quick if you're not paying attention. I'm not looking to get any of these buffs here. Just help my team get them. I'd like to save my abilities for the upcoming assault here. And again, I'm going to use those boots to get right out of dodge and start setting up the next bird bomb here. We've got a very aggressive Athena. Very aggressive Athena, which is cool. Alright. We're just going to chill a little bit longer before we go back and buy. We got our alt now, so that's a good thing. How about I kill that guy? Again, Daji. 
the teleport out of nowhere. I gotcha. All right, so rolling back out here. We got our boots up. We're going to think about going transcendence here. We'll see how the minion killing opportunities are. I really want to get that dodgy. Can't get Neath. I have no abilities. I know I'm going to need cooldown here. There's another part of this. Just soaking up some of the experience and side knot. I'm going to go back and buy the next level here. This is something I actually rarely do. I rarely port back, but I'm going to here because, well, if my team needed me, I could get, a, get out of it and, and, and helped in there. But we were okay. Got our jump up and ready. We're looking for it. Here it is. Tried to pull him back in through the fumes there. Again, looking for the next jump here. Be right back. And no. Not going to do that with uh, teammate going down there. Uh, I want to give chase, but it's just too early. I will end up dead. And that's the number one rule of smite, folks. Don't die. Oh, nice. The nice timely backflip. Had a little trouble there with some fat fingered moments. That happens to Dirt Nap's dad every now and then. Uh, you see, my fingers are actually relatively fat. Stubby. My wife calls them sausages. And I ran out of mana. Yeah, let's go back and finish. What's not going to make that a problem anymore? Little body blocks for the win. Me and Poseidon. Nice. So we'll start building some stacks here, which with Poseidon and whatnot could be a little harder than normal, but I'm still feeling it. Yeah, me too. I'm building stacks. So we're both building stacks. You're going to have that sometimes. Okay. Uh, be right back. Really don't have nothing there on that. I'm gonna miss you, bro. An ally has been slain. Oh, miss them, oh, she went the other way. But, 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 yes, that's what we do. And then we use those Teleria boots to get right out of dodge because we were not in a good place there. My name is my name. You won't get the cane. Get some of them stacks. Slow her down. Been around. Oh, that's how you Odin. We need some cooldown, though. We definitely need some cooldown here. Wait for the next wave. That's how a team does it. They follow my lead. I go in. I get the initiation. The team follows suit. Oh, nice sweep out. Nice dodge on my part. We're going to have to back up now. Ah, we're going to do a be right back. Be right back.
Another nice thing about those boots is they do give me a nice speedy retreat back to here. Again, I don't really port back often. So we're going to go some cooldown. That's going to come via Jotun's. Oh, we also get a relic. And I'm feeling... Blink. I'm feeling Blink because sometimes I want to put down my alt and then be able to bird bomb. So sorry there. Let your meatball missed. Then we're gonna bail out of there. They got good pressure. On over here, just missed the niece with the bird bomb. Let's try and draw him in here with Terra. Oh, we still need that cooldown. That 20% is going to mean a lot. Hey, niece. Well, tip for tat. I took her, she took me. Another good item here for Arena. Get some extra protections when I'm in that crowd. Oh, where we got going here? I don't want to engage there. I want to get a... Uh... Try and bait him back in. Don't have any help, so I'm not going to pursue that any further. Just wanted to kind of push him back. Oh, hey. Hello. Oh. Did not see the dodgy coming, and I was not prepared for hitting my sh Spatial awareness, folks. Helps to have some, especially in Arena. Got to keep an eye on that many maps. Because it's very important to know where everybody's at. What do we got here? What do we got? Tried to go in for the behind them there. Not gonna let our Lang and Athena have any fun there. We're going to let her go with the thorns up. What are you doing way out here? Hi, Tara. Yeah. Oh, I would have loved to have pursued that, but I know that I was not going to take that. Nice. Agni taking down Vulcan. So we pull back here. We're going to finish off our item, which I'm not even paying attention to the name. I think it's Masume. Maybe. My name is my name. Unstoppable. <laughs> I got 99 problems, but you Bitch ass ain't one of them. Oh, not what I wanted to do. But it still worked in the end. She died. Oh! 
Oh, Daji! You did not expect the reverse circle swipe. Oh, no. I'm so sorry. That was for you. <laughs> oh, my. That was a fun little moment there. That, 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 that was worth this whole game. Just, just that moment. She better be dead. Hey, get out of here. Yep, I know. Uh huh. Come back here. I have friends. I don't need stacks anymore. Alright, just play a little conservatively. We are ahead here, but. Same time. Oh! Oh, sorry, niece. Was that for me? Um, pardon me, dear, but you missed. Oh, and I missed her. So, tit for tat again. I am untouchable. And yeah, Daji, she's untouchable. Can't do anything if my abilities are down. I am just dead. I should not have taken teleport. That's what that comes down to. What is that? 1400? How much time we got left? Yes, we can! Alright, so we're gonna wait. We're gonna finish off Mantle of Discord before we go out. That'll help a little bit with Daji when she gets on me here. Since we bought Teleport, let's see if we can use it to an effect, maybe? That's how you do it! That's why we bought Teleport! That is why, right there. Hey, 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 you, you! Oh, let's try to body block for Agni there. Pull back, ladies and gents. We have a moment's pause for our fallen heroes. And forward. Yeah, it was a little premature. Oh, God. Way to go, Terra. That was awesome. I wish I would have been ready for that. You won't get paid. Oh, fool! 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 Nine bombs, but you ain't one. All right. Well, that was a little fun episode there. Sorry, I kind of quieted down, but. You know, sometimes when you're in the groove, you just kind of zone in and you have a little fun. You know, I think this would be a fun item right now. So let's go back out here. Look for the first bird bomb opportunity. It's coming up here. Where is it at? Oh! Thought they would get it back around the tower there. Not quite. Yep, and then we're gonna head back out. My team's back here. Except for Terra.
And we're going to buy that. Don't want that. Let's see what we can do for an ending here. Oh, come on. There it was, right in front of me. Watch Agni take down Vulcan once again for the kill. 71 to 0. That was a fun little match. Looks like I finished 8, 4, and 15. That's how I like to bird bomb. I like the how the Teleria boots give you that almost tactical strike feel of in and out. You get in, you do your damage, you get out. As soon as you're out of combat, you get that little extra boost of speed, which just helps you just get that separation that you need. And you circle back around. It's giving you some health regen. You're looking for the next bird bomb. And in you go. I love the, the extra movement speed with Odin, especially in the arena mode. It, it fits well. So we got some good favor there. We've got a couple worshippers all well on our way to level four with them. Some fantasy points and personal honor there. Shout outs to the team, Terra 3, 1, and 21. She was she was a boss out there. Agni doing well, 7, 8, 13. Kali, 8, 9, and 12. Poseidon, 8, 8, and 13. And I rounded out our team at 8, 4, and 15. Looking at the details here, we had solid damage all around. 22, 21, 5, 26, 5, 18, 20, all but 23 with myself. Other team actually out damaged us to some extent with uh, Vulcan leading the way and then even their Daji and Erlang topping out our group. But in the end, the victory goes to us. So do the spoils. This is Dirt Nap Dad. Hope you enjoyed the video. Hope you learned something. Hope you picked up something new. Hope this recorded the whole way to the end. Still working on all the issues. We'll get it right here. Hit that subscribe button. Tell your friends. Have a good day. I'm out.